previously on. What the hell? Hey, yo. Do you see what I'm seeing right now? Oh, great. How convenient. Okay. That's nice. That's really nice. Alright. Stay close. I'm gonna blow the motherfucker to bits myself. Alright, Bill. You do whatever you want to do at this point. I'm, I'm just... gonna do it. I'm gonna fucking kill him. Why'd you shoot him? I was holding a gun. I didn't like the way they looked at me, and I had the power to stop them. Sociopath. You... You murdered my son. That is something I can never forgive. As she should. I truly do regret the pain I have caused you. Out of my house, no! Just go, please. Out, all of you! We should leave, really. Please, Mrs. Elamar. I said we should leave. It's okay. Just go. You took my Reuben from me. My child. My son. Let's go back to the car. This whole visit was just a bad idea. Like, I don't know what type of outcome you were expecting. But this was not it at all. Just because you killed someone and said, Oh, I'm sorry, doesn't mean anything. Sorry doesn't bring back her fucking kid, bro. Like, I don't know. This guy is a nut job at this point. Damn, are you having that much trouble with the car, bro? Like... Just wish I could have talked to Gloria, you know, explained everything. You know, somehow I thought... I, I thought she'd find it in her heart to forgive me. Time to grab a bite to eat. Who could blame her? It's not easy to forgive your son's murderer. Yeah. Stevenson, we all knew how that would end. If you forgive anyone their sins, they are forgiven. If you do not forgive them, they are not forgiven. <sighs> really aim to spin a virtue of your crucifixion? Ugh, yes, really. You'll be kicking up a shit storm. Haters gonna hate. It is something I'm... For if this won't shake the world to its core and wake us from our collective nightmare, then nothing will. Are you trying to do this because you think if you crucify yourself, you'll suddenly become like a righteous good person again? Because... That's still bullshit. Like... You may have gotten forgiveness from God himself, but that doesn't erase the fact that you did set sins, per se. Take Stevenson inside, grab us all at need a word with our stowaway here. Stow away? Fuck you, bitch. How rude. Yo, the way this guy drives, he's giving me some whiplash because I'm starting to get motion sickness. Wait up a sec, I want to talk. Mm. Oh, you so, cute. So, what do you think about our next big BD star? He's got some organic chips loose. Needs psychiatric help. Hmm. My thoughts exactly. But it's too late for that. If he's as crazy as you say, why is he so important to you? Yeah, because catch. Stevenson's got a little something that's in short supply, but in very high demand. That little something's called authenticity. And that brain composed entirely of cat shit at this point. He truly believes what he says. Think he might be more self-possessed than you think. Look, you're no shrink and neither am I. We're both just out to get paid. Hmm, okay. Stevenson could be a fat old fucking gold vein for our studio. And that's my concern because... 
You're fucking with his mind, asking probing questions. You're making him doubt, and most importantly, jeopardizing my investment. So I'm prepared to pay you double what he's promised you to quietly walk away. Don't do it, V. You really think that you can buy me off? <laughs> okay. My answer is no. Why do I think you don't understand what I'm offering you? I do. I understand just don't care just for fine. your fucking money. Let's go inside. Look at that, she's pissed. Not bad for a petty mark off the streets. Grown curious how this will all end. In pain and profit, that's how. One's sacred, the other's insane. Though who knows if they aren't congruous concepts. But yeah, I'm curious too. And I've been surprised before. Hmm. Time to go into the diner. Got a tough customer with that Vasquez. Even for a badge. He is set in his ways. Like so many men. What the fuck are you eating? Is that supposed to be french fries on top of steak? Vasquez. He blew inside and out. Might as well have been born with a badge. Hmm. Must have some solid dirt on him then. And the studio majority stakeholder's a corp. Unlike you, Vasquez would clearly mind having enemies in high places. This brain dance. I'm curious. Tell me more. Title's the passion. We're speaking to the LCD, of course. Cliché. It's gonna revolutionize BD. That is so, so? cliché. Well, Stevenson's furlough is only so long. You can only scroll the last bit with him. But we'll fill in the run-up to the finale with BD doubles and Nemo Bank assets. It'll feel like Stevenson, though. How is that even possible? Give me a break. We're part of EBM. Infinite investment in tech. A couple of years and we won't be using actors anymore. My dream of the day. So why Josh? Sounds like you don't even need him now. The son of man's agony. You can't weave it strictly out of digital threads just yet. And you? Got any say in all this? He forced the writers to go with the Christian gospel according to Luke. They'd originally opted for John. Mm, yes, that's important for... John's version is crude and over the top. The gospel of Luke speaks more to my sensibility. How ironic. Besides, Luke's Christ is prepared for what awaits him. I want the world to understand that. Feel it. Of course. Like, your killings were not over the top, right? Sound like an actor who really wants to become the part. I only have one shot at this. I, I need to make a count. Mm -hmm. really believe you're like Jesus. I, I believe we should all follow his example. Chatter's pointless. That's enough. Stevenson can't be distracted. He has to focus now. Joshua and I are talking, so fuck off, will ya? Excuse me? Realize the stakes here. Tomorrow, this guy's gonna create his masterwork. He needs to focus, keep his head in the game, and put in the performance of his lifetime. There aren't any do-overs. Joshua? I'd like to rest now. Perfect timing. Your job's done here. You can go. And don't worry, you'll get your fucking money. Goodbye, V. You really are going through with this, aren't you? Really well played. What do you make of Guy just might be the biggest nut job I've ever seen, but it's still corporate exploitation. I'm talking to you. Your cynicism starting to thin on me. We could talk in circles, but who cares what we think? What would it change? 
corpse will continue to grow rich off his type, and the masses will live on with their pipe dreams. Hmm. Hang on, where's Rebel Johnny? You seem to have lost him. Well, I found him. He's inside that guy. Joshua? He's the real Rebel. Oh, Lord. Up your mind. Which is it, Nut Job or Messiah? He's fucked in the head. The world's fucked in the head. And you're fucked in the head because my fucked up head is inside it. Fuck that guess if you want to save the world, that's the first step. Get fucked in the head. Mm. Well, in that case, I don't want to save the world. What do you think? God exists. Fuck. Kill me, please. Come on. Serious question. What? Why? So you flatlined, then got your beat back. Don't tell me that's left you wondering if a construct can even be saved. Truth is, I died and rose again. Plain and simple. Exactly. Uh huh. So what was that? A miracle? What's it make you? A messiah, a phoenix, or a factory restored early model archer? I had no fucking idea what it was, and neither do you. Tell you exactly what brought you back. A clever bit of corpo tech. If there's a true messiah among us, I'll tell you who it is. Saburo Arasaka. Hmm? One you'd summarily execute if you ran into him. See, that's why I'm me and you're you. You drop to your knees before gods. I drop them. Pop them right between the eyes. I like that quote. That quote is so badass. You're gonna tell me you don't think about being a digital psyche? Possible consequences thereof. Really? I mean, are you already dead? Or alive till the last existing digighost of you is shredded? Meaning, like, am I gonna ascend to digi heaven? Descent to digi hell's more likely, but yeah. The shade. There is life after death. Is Silverhand already living the afterlife? Meaning, I'm talking to his animated epitaph? I don't give it an ounce of thought. Surprise. To me, I'm just that. Me. No nether world, no happy wonder world, just duped digital sight. Weird as fuck. It's kind of unreal. But reality beckons. Come on, we got places to trash. I just realized that I had a philosophical conversation by myself. No wonder this guy kept staring at me. And number two, whoever that's on that plate is really fucking nasty. Like, I wouldn't even eat that shit. And I love eating. Okay. Ooh, Claire. Hey. Next race is in the Badlands. The nomads don't fuck around when it comes to burning rubber on their home turf, so I'm gonna need you to... in top form, like for reals. Meet at the end of the Brookland Street at the new dam. Call like last time. Alright, so... I'll definitely go ahead and... Me, Claire. And I'll use this nice little car, too. Damn! Easy on the brakes, shit. Alright, I'm ready to go. Oof, I felt that. At this point, I'm gonna need new tires. Alright, let me go and call Claire. Hey, Claire. Next race. You ready? It'll be a tough one. Off-road, lots of lead flying. Damn. I'll take Beast. I want to try her out in the field. Nova. FYI, I'm already here. Perfect. Join you in a sec. Sounds good. See ya. Alright. Nice little sit and wait. No, no, I don't have it. Well, how am I supposed to know who's got it? Dude, this is your problem, not mine. 
Nice! New racers, new cars. Can't wait. Hey, V! Good to see you again. Got another race to run, huh? Second of four, I hope. Ready to go off-road? Hell yeah. Not a fan-friendly event, is it? You want to bake in this sun. Speed, carnage, a crunching metal symphony. Yeah, dull stuff. Looks like Aldecaldo's fronted a solid team. Aldecaldo's? This is their race. Pam man crew? Are they wrong? Nomad team usually wins this one, so no. Guess not. Shit. Okay, I'm just gonna melt under that sun, so I'm gonna wait in the car. Sure. I'm coming in. Hey guys, remember! Huh. Maximum madness! I really thought you'd stand me up again. I thought Booty would have to ride shotgun. Booty is a fantastic shot. He is, he is. Oh, but he's talking always. Too much. Alright. I'm ready. Luigi tries to get people's heads. You there! So hey. next time I yeah. actually What's don't up? make it, there's Just duct tape in the trunk. You Just Thank say you. Eggs. Whatever. Alright, I'm ready. All right, move. Never surrender. Damn, this shit's crazy. Oh no, it's jumpy. Oh lord. Okay, okay. All right. This shit's insane. Yeah, I can tell. I can tell it's hella tough. But we're in first place, so fuck it. Now the question is, is it going to be a smooth ride? Who knows? I'm just trying to make it as clean as possible because this terrain, ooh, it's really messing up the car. No, 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 no. Okay, okay, good. I'm going easy on the gas because this place is getting really too slippery. And I can tell this is going to be a couple of rough, sharp corners, so I'm not trying to mess it up. I really hope she has car insurance because she's going to need to repair the living shit out of this car afterwards. Okay, so we're about like, they're what, 33% done with this race? And so far, there hasn't been any cars catching up to us, so... I'm actually pretty hopeful. Oh my god, we're driving into the sandstorm. Yeah, I'm careful. This shit's insane. Oof. This is one crazy race, I'll give you that. I'm not even pressing fully on the brakes either. I'm not trying to like crash into anything or have this car overturn in any way, shape, or form. Yeah, this is really intense. I can't even see shit. Like, at all. Okay, not bad. I'm surprised. Not bad at all. Alright, let me see where we're heading to. At this point, what, well, we're around 60, 65% done with the race? Because I see I did 25 out of 35 checkpoints, so 10 more go at this point. Wait, we're actually going through here? We could do that?
You know what? I'm going slow because how much do you want to bet there's going to be a like crazy sharp corner just for shits and giggles? Because I'm not trying to like jinx this at all. So. Okay, 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 okay. We got this. We got this. We got this. And I definitely want to win too. Just so. Claire can be impressed with my driving skills, so... Uh, come on, come on, come on, yes! Okay. We're actually doing good, we're kicking ass. And I don't think there's any cars behind us at all either. And we're almost done. We got two more checkpoints, so... We got this. All right. Oh yeah. Our winners today, Fee and Claire. Yes. We did it, Fee. We won. Wasn't easy. Drive up to the finish line. Okay, bet. Not bad. <laughs> A little bunny. That's cute. How am I doing? You're too wide around corners and slow down the last straightaway, but Damn. I'm picking. Okay. So, no regrets putting me behind the wheel? Not yet. The last driver was better than I am? He was. A good husband. An amazing wheelman. Wow, I'm so sorry. How did he die, if you don't mind my asking? How do any competitive racers die? We reached the final last year. We were strong. Out in front when... Maybe we should change the subject. Yeah. You want a lift to my garage? Find my own way there. Thanks. All right, see ya. See ya, Claire. Why, no way the missus will believe I bet on the winning horse. No, oh, no, it's my relic acting up oh, again. Shit, not good. Oh my god, let me get out. Last thing I need is to pass out in the middle of the fucking desert. Um, good job? Anyways. Alright, let me check out any jobs that are available for me to do at this point. Okay, so I'm going to meet with Elizabeth Perales, whatever her last name is. And why is my bike driving away? Why is my bike driving away? Wow. I hate these fucking glitches. Okay. Let's try this one. Okay, I guess I'll walk to my bike. Like, what's the point in calling a bike if I have to walk to it? It's supposed to be right then and there, but whatever. Ooh. B, would you like to drive it? Hell yeah. Sure. Be there soon. Fuck me. It is awesome. So I hear. What do you think? Ain't she just a beauty? Holy shit, that thing looks so crazy. Drop by the camp, stills don't do her justice. And maybe you cheer up Pam Ma'am. Oh lord. I think the people at the camp ship us low key. Well fuck it. On my way to meet Pam Ma'am. Project, oh yeah, what's up? We've got a crisis on our hands. Really use your help. Stevenson's had a breakdown. Nothing any shrink can do about it. Can you come here to the studio just to talk to him? 
I thought you said you didn't want me around. Fine, sure, on my way. She said Thank you so much for watching this episode. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.